Brady and company coming out, and man, was it a celebration. Well, listen, in the pregame, Tom Brady was fired up, so he knew he was ready to play. Well, here, here's Brady here to Julian Edelman for 13 yards, and this would certainly be a theme on this night. Well, they well, started the game off early, and when all they were doing was just nickel and diming and just taking what they were giving them. And here, it started, this is the beginning of the Pittsburgh Steelers, just simply not covering Gronk and smart on, on, on on Brady's part to make certain that they started rushing things as we see to make yep. certain that they could get this play You can off. see him right here just saying there's nobody on him. I got to go to him as soon as possible and then Gronk breaks a tackle and takes care of the rest. You need more than one man especially if you yeah. to bring him down. No offense. Well and you got to want those DBs to actually want to tackle Gronk too. That might be able to help. Uh, then you look at this little touch pass. Just yeah. drops it in there to Danny and the goal. This is one that I think Tommy wants back. Completion, yes, but there was a lot more meat on that bone if the ball was a little bit inside. This one, typical Brady Gronk. Nice touch pass. What Pittsburgh's defense was doing, I'm not sure, E.D. I know what they well, were Listen, doing. if you're going to put two guys on Gronk, <laughs> at least at the very minimum, one guy has to put his hands on him. Even if you got to hold him down the red zone, you can't get one hand on Gronk and expect him not to go up and high point the ball in the back of the end zone. A lot of missing pieces for the Steelers tonight. You saw him there, Le'Veon Bell, Marquise Pouncey, and Martavis Bryant, and this is one of the fill-ins, D'Angelo Williams, and he had himself a night replacing Le'Veon Bell. I, I think this is definitely a big pickup for these guys, and this right here is a way to get yourself back at home when your kicker missing it, but it's having D'Angelo on this team is going to be big for them until they get Le'Veon Bell. That was their third kicker. I mean, yeah, they've Josh been snake in there. Filling in for uh, Sean Sweezen, who's on IR, and Ben Roethlisberger getting dragged down by Dante Hightower. you got to give Hightower credit. Ben is one of the best at avoiding uh, tackles in the pocket, it's avoiding sacks in the yep. pocket. Uh, but Pouncey, Cody, Cody Wallace. Yeah, Cody Pouncey Wallace, wouldn't have let that yeah, happen. Pouncey, I mean, you got the protection. It's one-on-one. -on -one. That's Cody Wallace instead of Pouncey. They but you attack, attack the weakness. Yeah, True. You attack yep. the weakness. You yeah. got a young guy there, you attack it. They attacked it. Well, perhaps Darius Hayward Bay oh. could save them in the end zone or not. Yeah, well, you, you look at this is what was happening in this game the first half a tale of what could have been yeah uh, DHB gets back there he can't do it you missed two uh, field goals that could have definitely changed the complexion of the they, did, they did eventually get a field goal from Josh Scobie here but Brady comes right back and hits the other tight end the new one Scott Chandler for the yep. on this play I was telling Nate the Patriots test your rules you get a linebacker out in space on this play if you have a corner they understand you run into that defender that's a pick play yep linebacker runs around it he's not comfortable that's what they were expecting Expecting. They got a touchdown out of it. Now here comes Big Ben looking for his go-to guy, Antonio Brown, and it works out here good for 33 yards. This is another one of those plays where on the replay, Malcolm was in his hip pocket and just scramble rules got him beat. Then on third and goal, Will Johnson just squeaks over the goal line for the touchdown. The Steelers go for two and get it, but they still trail 21 to 11. Here's D'Angelo Williams on first and Set the edge, Another bitch. nice chunk, this time 12 yards for D'Angelo. Listen, that. again, week one mistakes. You, you saw defensive mistakes from veteran guys for Bill Belichick's defense that you normally don't see. Hey, Nate, what's this? A great this catch. Is, toe, drag, swag. What was that, Nate? <laughs> toe, drag, swag. No, what, what I like about this is that we work on this drill every day in practice. It's a distraction drill. Guy getting his hands right in front of your sight. I love the fact that Marcus Sweden did not let that ball out of his vision. Yeah, well, I like the fact that the that the, the new um, safety rules are enforced because old school, he would have gotten de decapitated. Yeah. You're right. But Cordy wouldn't have been going for the interception. No. Going for his ribs. That, that's a false start right there on Kelvin Beach. So the Steelers have to back it up five yards. Roethlisberger is none too pleased. Patriots come back on the ensuing how this how, how, wide how, open again. how how many times did we see one on none coverage <laughs> on Gronk? It, <laughs> it's, it's Gronk, so forget about all the talking about putting your hands on him. Blown assignments in that secondary, it's killing him. Yeah. Here's Brady to, to Deion Apple. Lewis, and check out Mike Mitchell getting the ball and, and, and knocking it out there. Well, but but Gronk's Johnny on the spot recovers I, it I for what a, would be a touchdown. Good job, Gronk. That was Deion's sole mistake of the night. The young running back played well, had a couple tough years with injuries. Played extremely well for this team tonight, but he's got to hold on to the ball because Bill Belichick will sit your butt down they, if you don't. They initially ruled it a touchdown. They reverse the call, then they go right back uh -huh. to Gronk. His third TD of the evening, and the Patriots up 28 to 14. Fantasy owners of Rob Gronkowski, congratulations. <laughs> Later in the fourth, Big Ben trying to make something happen with seven minutes to go. Uh, Looking deep for Darius Hayward Bay. Picked off by Deron Hart. Well, bad play by Big Ben. Nice way to catch it in the back. Uh, well, right now, I mean, that's just basically a punt. He's just throwing it up, trying to get something to happen.
All right, so 28-21 the final. Not exactly a bloodbath as Heath promised us yesterday, but, you know, Heath has been... Uh, he's been right and he's been wrong before. I'm not going to pile on you, buddy. I think this oh, was a fine. great game to open up the season, and Tom Brady came out and just put on a show. Mm.